right? The mother, it's harder on the mother because she has lost a child. And many uh, people do not think of a miscarriage as the loss of a child. But for the mother, it, it creates a, a deep sense of grief that sometimes never able to be expressed. Mm, yeah. So that is you know, also part of the soul agreement between okay. the child and, and the mother. Many times the souls that uh, have, have miscarried will will come back again and then uh, be uh, uh, taken to full term and, and born. So okay, it all depends. I want you to know, beloved one, that what you're doing is important. It's important work. Mm. You're doing spirit's work in the world. Thank you. And thank you to all within earshot of this for what you do what you bring as service. Thank you. It means a lot. Thank you. All right. I feel complete. As do we. Thank you so <laughs> much for allowing us to be with you today. My pleasure. Thank you. Indeed. Namaste. Namaste. What is an archangel? Right. Let's start with that. All right. That's a, good, a really good question. Because angels are a race, race of beings, as humans are a race of beings. But the angels are, of course, celestial beings. Right? And within the hierarchy of those celestial beings, you know, each hierarchy has a different job. And so the archangels' jobs, uh, while they appear uh, to be special, right? We are the champions of humanity. We are here for you, uh, supporting your evolutionary process, your ascension, right? We are creators. The, the cosmos, the universe, is there's so much there that you have no point of reference for, but we assist the Creator in whatever job we're given. Much like you follow the, the whisperings of your guidance and do what Spirit asks you to do, beloved one, we too follow the voice of God and do what we're asked to do. 